Today in our sports encyclopedia series, we talk about Sepak Takraw. So let's begin. Sepak Takraw, also known as Sepak Raka and Takraw, is a modified variant of volleyball that originated in Southeast Asia. Sepak Takraw involves players not using their hands to play the ball and are required to use their feet, head, knees, and chest to touch the ball. The basic objective of the game for each player is to score more points than the opposition by causing their opponents to commit a fault that results in a score being awarded. How to play Sepak Takraw? Sepak Takraw is a team sport that involves two teams competing against each other. Each team in Sepak Takraw consists of three players, and each player plays a specific position. The balls used in the game are made of a number of synthetic materials. Balls must be woven, and they must consist of 12 holes and 12 intersections, and be within the regulation size and weight. A match of Sepak Takraw is played on a court that's similar to a double-sized badminton court. There is a net stretched across the center of the court at a height of 1.5 meters for men and 1.42 meters for women. The game begins with a coin toss that decides which team will serve first to commence. The play is initiated when the server is thrown the ball by a teammate and he must kick the ball over the net while keeping one foot in the service circle. Throughout the match, players are only required to touch the ball with their feet, head, knees, and chest. If any player of the team touches the ball with their hand or any other part of the body, it results in a fault and a point for the opposition. The team is allowed a maximum of three touches of the ball before they return it back over the net without letting it touch the ground. If a team fails to return the ball over the net or it hits the ground, it results in a point for the opposition. The only way to score points in Sepak Takraw is by making the fault, and this can be done in a number of ways. Number one, if the server jumps off the ground while making a service. Two, the server forgot to lick the ball before serving. Three, if an inside player touches the net while throwing the ball. Four, the ball hits the net or fails to cross the, into the opposition's half. Five, if the ball lands outside the court's boundaries. Six, keeping possession of the ball for more than three hits in a row. Seven, if a player touches the ball on the opposition's side. Eight, if the ball touches an arm of any player. Nine, if a player holds or grabs the player. 10. If the ball touches the ceiling or any other object when thrown. How to win in Sepak Takraw? The team that manages to get to 21 points first wins the first set. First team who wins two sets is declared as the winner. If you like the video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.